Good afternoon, guys. Um, I just want to say thank you to AB's Fishing for these glasses that I'm wearing right now, these Polaroids. They are enabling me to see some of the bears much better when the sun is a little bit um, not in my favor. But I just caught this little one. It's about a 200 gram fat little Sally. And for some reason, the bass has started to show some um, spawning signs again. That includes the um, both beds and the um, the injuries that they sustain sometimes from either making the bed or from protecting the bed. Um, so these bears are showing that and I think it's because of our weather patterns that we had here in South Africa because our weather was weird. And after that the bears has been, well, like they've been on beds. Um, it's just that's the patterns I'm getting. So it's either that or there's been a very big bass that tried to take a chunk out of this guy and just just missed. So, um, but he's not the first bass that I see with this. I see quite a lot of them with with it, um, and it's not those. Um, it's not a fungi or anything related. It's literally just like a cut mark or anything like that. But let's release this little guy. So here we go. Give, give him some air. Oh, and a jump. <laughs> oh, once again a jump. I haven't seen a jump in quite a while. They're getting rolled up again. I'm happy. See you in the next video. How's it, guys? Um, sorry, I just wanted to make sure that I'm going to sit down actually on the chair and not on the ground. Um, just want to say, on the previous video, I did some research to find out if bass can actually spawn a second time in a year. Um, you know, for in case somebody wants to argue with me or anything like that. Found out that it is possible, if the weather conditions is right, that bass will then go into a second spawning, sometimes even a false spawn. Um, just giving the behavior, but they're not physically spawning. Um, just depending on what's going on, but scientists have found that in the fall bass might start spawning again if the weather conditions is correct um, and with our weather conditions in South Africa this year being quite similar to what it was in spring I'm not surprised to see bass with spawning marks and um, bed-like structures and um, bass around beds and stuff like that um, that doesn't mean that's the same thing for every dam in South Africa. It doesn't mean it's going to be like that for all the bass. It might just be a couple of bass that feels that they can that feel that they can spawn now again, or the the temperatures is correct for them to spawn. Um, but that's something that I found. So um, yeah, I just wanted to mention that I did do some research. It is possible. Um, but it's also possible that due to the hot weather we've been having that these marks resemble um, spawning um, activity but it's actually the bass pushing through um, reeds and um, reed beds trying to get into deeper shade so um, it depends it will all depend on if I can see baby bass within the next couple of months um, you know more baby bears at the stage we've got fingerlings from the last spawning season so I'll be able to identify between you know the two because they are now about this size so new bass will be about that size um, so yeah I, I did go do the research it is possible hopefully because this dam does need more bass quite a lot more um, it's um, staffed, staffed from bass when it comes to that you know there's not a lot, lot of them in here um, it's a very healthy dam, but um, some of the fish are struggling due to uh, overpopulated catfish um, populations. So um, hopefully the bass is doing very well this season and they can spawn a second time. We can have a lot of babies that can then grow up to eat baby catfish. And then, you know, the dam can sort out its own ecosystem without human in interference. But uh, yeah, thanks a lot for watching and uh, subscribe to my channel on YouTube, please, guys. Um, every subscription is just more support. <coughs> and um, 
if you want me to share anything any info uh, if you want me to do some re research on something on any type of um, fish or anything like that comment below um, I will read your comments I might not get back to you the same day but I will get back to you that's a promise um, but yeah subscribe comment and uh, give me a like if you like what you see cheers